<laughs> what is up realists welcome to on the real fishing thank you guys so much for all your support make sure you hit like on the videos that you want to see more of and today we're just out in the kayak a lot of days i don't really have a goal i just get out fish and hopefully we catch something but today i really want to catch some crappie that's the goal so i've got three different options to go with today we've got live minnows right down there in the bottom of the kayak and I've also got two of the newer micro finesse um, jig head options, jig head options, the micro finesse baits from Z-Man to mess with. So I've got the micro goat, I've got this in green pumpkin black and also got it in just a black color. And then I've got some of these baby ballers which are basically a uh, like a little minnow type looking thing. I've got two colors in this as well. So hopefully we'll find something, that's the goal. We got wind blowing in from this way right now, so we're gonna be trying to hit this cove where the wind is not blowing the water, but you never know. It's part of fishing, sometimes you gotta find it, but I've had some luck here in this cove before, so we'll see what happens. So let's get on the reel, go try to catch some fish. Okay, so I think the first goal here, I think we're gonna to try to start out here on the point, pull up our way back. I'll probably try to predominantly use live bait, but, when we get kind of even more cover and stuff like that, I might switch over to some of the, the non-live bait stuff. But I think our best bet's gonna be live bait. So that's what I'm gonna try first and foremost. Of course, always with the kayak, it's always the struggle of trying to manage where it's gonna be. So, all right, let's get a minnow on. We're gonna try right here first. Let's see if we can't find anything kind of sitting around here, so. Alrighty, our first minnow is on and out. Let's see how long it takes for us to get any kind of action on there. Minnow's doing its job, it's out there kind of booping around. But we'll see. So we'll go to the right here, clear our way so we can. Toss the goat out there. Keep an eyeball on that bobber just in case. But got a little chartreuse jig head on here. Hopefully that'll get some attention with this cloudy day. But first cast on this guy. Oh gosh, the skipjack, I'm pretty sure. That was a big old thump. <laughs> Alright, first cast got a good thump. That's kind of frustrating though that that got a thump and uh, the minnow is just out there chilling. <laughs> Some bites right there. Overreacting a little bit. I haven't caught anything yet so I'm like all anxious to catch something. bites. Kayak is getting too close now, I think. need to wait until after they pull it. <laughs> of course I'm parallel with the bank now so the likelihood of finding bites now is going to be a little bit higher because I'm going to be running across more potential fish's faces. There we go, we finally got our first fish. What are we end up getting today? First fish to be on the goat. So we've got a little bluegill there. A bunch of little boom booms. Uh oh. Minnows running from something as well. There we go. First little bluegill there. Not too bad.
There we go. Second fish on the old goat with a little bluegill. Ah! A little bitty bluegill there. Very nice. There we go, got another fish finally. Still on the goat, nothing on the minnow yet. What we get over here? Oh, nice. Got a nice bluegill. Oh, I hit my, hit my reverse button. If I want to hit the reverse button, stop. Reverse button. There we go. Definitely don't, oh, there's a nice size bluegill here. Well, we're going to it too much. All right. Nice size bluegill here. First good sized fish of the day. It's skinny though. First good sized fish of the day. It's a nice tall size, but he's super skinny. He's eat some minnows. See you, buddy. Yeah, one good size one out of the way. Not sure if we can find any more, but we'll sure try. That's the goal. Get out and try. Still haven't got a crappie yet though. Hopefully we might find some over there across the way with some grass, some grass on the point over here. So we'll see what happens over there. There we go, another one off the bank. What we got? What bluegill looks like. Decent little bluegill. There we go, another one there. Alright, got four fish. All bluegills, no crappie. Uh -huh. There we go. Ooh, oh, what was that? <laughs> Pretty good something. I don't bite again, but maybe there's more over there. There we go, we got something again. Ooh, good fighter. Yeah, those are a good old bluegill. Good old bluegill. So the bluegill are up today and not the crappie. But the bluegill aren't wanting any minnows. They're just wanting this toad. A tiny toad. There we go. Another nice little bluegill. Well, hello, sunshine. There we go. We got something good. What do we get? The crappie? Did we find a crappie on the goat? We did. Oh my goodness, what a sweet crappie. Look at there, we made it. We did it. I just gotta get it in the boat. It's heavy. Oh my goodness, look at this slab. Look at this beast. Oh my goodness. Just barely got him over there. Kept throwing where I was catching bluegill. Look at there, look at there. Awesome. Took us a long time. I haven't even looked at my watch. We'll see what how much long how long it's taken us to find these guys. But what a beautiful crappie. That's definitely probably a keeper. I don't have my measurer up here at all, but definitely probably a good size keeper there. Very cool. <laughs> Found him. See if we can get another. 
All right, so I checked on the time there. It's been an hour and a half. We've been out here trying to catch some fish, trying to find some crappie. We've gotten some bluegill, but that is the first crappie we've found. And it was way up in the grass, or just right off the grass. So I've thrown the minnow back out yonder. I need to tilt the, oh, maybe not. Maybe we got a bite already. I'm gonna turn the kayak a little bit. There we go, we got something. What do we get? Something finally thumped on it good. So we got another really nice bluegill here. Another nice bluegill. Got him. There we go. This one's not as thin as the other one. Show them off. I'm watching that bobber just kicking around. Another nice little bluegill there. Sweet. Got him. There we go. Another one. Definitely the bites picked up since we came out here to the grass. Still only have the one crappie on our hands. Another nice little bluegill. This almost looks like a shell cracker, but you don't have the, the red ears. Uh, my, my, my bobber's gone. <laughs> my bobber's gone. Bobber's gone. And the line's going crazy. Let's see if we got anything. Reel it in. There we go. Let's see if we got. That's something. Something finally bit a minnow. Oh, what do we get? On the minnow, we got ourselves a shell, <laughs> a shell cracker. No, we got ourselves a skipjack finally biting the minnow. Oh, awesome. First sh skipjack of the day. I figured we'd find some of these out here as well, but he's got this sucker deep, so we're gonna cut him and cut him and run because he's way deep. Alrighty. Little skipjack there, little skipjack. Skipjack, see you buddy. Yeah, he's got way deep, so I'm gonna snip him and run. So I think we're gonna take some time, reline this back up, and get back to fishing. Looks like things are picking up over here on this side. All right, we're all fixed back up. Just wanna go over my setup real quick. Just got a size six Aberdeen hook, little split shot there. We're just using a, a small weighted bobber there on the end and i got about set about three foot roughly and uh so that's all we're doing nothing special nothing crazy so all right let's see if we find another one there we go a little fish out from underneath there looks like it's probably a bluegill yeah another nice size bluegill the toads are definitely taking care of some bluegill that's for sure a nice size bluegill there Ooh, I skipped Jack 100%. <laughs> there it goes. Woohoo! There's this one, there's probably more. So, get out of that other thing's line. Just get a little hook set there right in the side. Get some tension going in the line there. Alrighty. Nice little catfish bait right there. Beautiful skipjack. Chasing stuff back in here. <laughs> See you, buddy. Oops, I got it. We got it. Say, probably a skipjack. I'll go underneath my underneath my line here. Oh yeah, another big old skipjack. Oof. Went after the minnow. Oh, wow. Catching fish now, but we able to get them loose. There we go, another skipjack on live minnow. There's 
There we go. Oh, come on. Another skipjack. They're everywhere. <laughs> Why y'all <are> everywhere? <laughs> Biggest one of the day, though, that's for sure. Biggest skippy of the day, that's for sure. Yeah. Look at this guy. Nice old jumbo size skipjack. Very cool. All right. Eventually we'll find another, another crappie. <laughs> Eventually. That's another skipjack, isn't it? Oh no, I think it's actually a bass. We got our first bass of the day, I think. Or is it a crappie? I can't tell you. Oh nope, another slab crop. Another slab crop. Same oh, same patch. Same patch of grass. Another awesome crappie. I knew we'd eventually find another one. There we go. Sweet. What a nice little crappie. Not too bad there. Is it right off that grass? It must be up in that. So very cool. Awesome. Thank you, sir. Two crappie on the day. All right, realists, that's going to wind it up for today. I said we used some live minnows and we ended up using the little micro Z Man TRD goat. Is it a TRD goat? No, it's just a micro goat. I don't know why. Because I had the TRD gobies the other day. If you haven't checked out that video, make sure you check it out. I'll put a little thingy right here for it. But. We did some good stuff. We only caught two crappie, but we were able to find crappie today in the grass. So it was pretty awesome. They were both really nice ones too. So, but we're going to be heading on for the day. If you guys haven't had a chance, make sure you check out some of the other videos. I'll post them right here. These are videos from the past and videos that have been recommended to you. So hopefully you get a chance to check those out if you haven't already. Make sure you like and subscribe if you like the content. And as always, Hopefully you guys have a great day, great night, great morning, whatever it is, wherever you are. Hopefully it's awesome. Hopefully you guys get a chance to get on the reel real soon. Check them out. Bonus fish. First bass of the day. Look how big it is. It's so huge. <laughs>